All right, I just wanted to make a quick video here describing how um, I kind of, obviously I'm using Schoology, but in Schoology, um, now that I'm in semester two, I switched my communication um, to make it much more clear about when assignments were due and when I would accept them. Um, so I noticed some confusion early on in a, last year about like when is this assignment exactly due and when can I turn it in even when I had specific uh, assignment dates on the assignments and I, I tried my best in class to communicate but I found that this is actually much more helpful so I kind of have color coded the folder so we are currently in um, week week four right now uh, or no I'm sorry we're currently in week three right now so week three because today's the 23rd, all of the assignments that are in this folder, which it just happens to be one assignment right here, it's going to be due on the 25th. Then I tell students when I'm going to grade them and the last day that I'm going to accept any uh, late or redo work. So students have the ability to redo or retake the assignments within this folder all the way up until Friday or Friday the 8th of February. Now I switched, uh, notice we have yellow and red here. Yellow means that at this point, this is last week assignments, if you complete any assignment in this folder, you now must fill out this missing assignment Google form. So rather than having students email me every time that like they finish a late assignment um, or they turn something in late or they redo an assignment rather than having them email me I have them fill out this missing assignment Google form um, and then I grade all late and missing work on Thursday morning so students know exactly when I'm gonna grade their work they don't have to worry about emailing me or anything like that they just fill out this form and then they know that on Thursday morning I will grade any of their late missing or redo work um, because they've filled out this form this folder is red. They also have to, if they complete anything, if they still haven't done any of this work that's in this folder, they still need to complete it. Um, but at, at this point, they have they have uh, the work is due on Friday, the 25th, um, and obviously that is this week. So this is a red folder. Um, just noting to them that next week they will no longer have access to this folder and I will no longer be accepting any of the work that is in this folder um, for credit. So um, students seem to be really responding to this folder situation really well um, and they like there's not been any confusion on due dates or missing work or late work. Can I do this? Can I not do that. You haven't graded this. I'm very clear about when I grade things. Um, I grade all missing assignments on Thursdays. Students know that. I grade all work like within the, the week folder every Monday so students know that their grades will be updated on Monday um, and it seems to be working out really well. I think the consistency um, is pretty helpful and on the folders just being very specific about the due dates um, so that when they spin them open they can see the assignments that have this date. So, Okay, hopefully this is helpful. Let me know if you have any questions.